Hey friends, so we are going to the beach and I'm gonna do some quick peach makeup just to kind of feel more put together. So I have washed my face and I haven't put any treatments on. Um, sometimes when I go to the beach, I like to just go straight from my cleanser to my moisturizer. Um, I don't know why. I At night, I like to do all the things. During the day from wearing makeup, I like to do all the things, but when I go to the beach, I just, go right from my cleanser to my moisturizer. So I'm gonna do super quick makeup. So I'm actually going to mix some stuff. So I've got our cleanser, not our cleanser, our daytime moisturizer and normal to oily. Um, got a lot of questions on moisturizer lately and I use the normal to oily right here. I have, you know, random acne that pops up. I'm oily, I used to have dry spots. So I've got really kind of combination skin and I have found that the normal to oily works the best. Okay, so that, and this is also mixed with our facial sunscreen, which is super important for the beach. So I'm getting um, this SPF 15 equivalent, the SPF 20, and then I'm gonna go in with some silk. So it hasn't dried yet. Um, like I said, this is kind of non-traditional. <laughs> way I do makeup, but for the beach, it works. So I'm doing our silk. Normally I do a brush, but I'm just kind of almost mixing it in. And then I'm gonna go in with our um, medium tinted moisturizer. And normally I would use a brush. I might go in with the brush, but I'm just gonna kind of still blend it because it still hasn't soaked in the moisturizer. So it's gonna be a little bit of a lighter version, but it's kind of my quick way. So it's just evening out my skin tone. You can see this little blemish up here. Right here, you can kind of see. We've been outside a lot in the dirt and planting and all the things. And so my face has been kind of getting beat up a little bit. So we might need a brush to kind of really get that little blemish covered, but it's gonna give it, there we go. It kind of covered it a little bit. If I wanted to go in with concealer, I could. If I wanted to cover it more, but I mean, we're just going to the beach, so I'm not too concerned about that. So it just gives it a nice overall even look. All right, we're going in with some eye illuminator. This is gonna wake me up. And it's gonna protect under my eyes all day. Get those wrinkles, fine lines. Give me a little bit of a glow. I've got a couple more things. I'm gonna use the new Smoky Taupe in my brows and in my eyes because, you know, when I go to the beach, I I don't wanna look, you know, too put together. I definitely need to pluck my brows. I don't wanna look too put together, but I do need a little bit of filling in on my brows. So I'm doing my brow gel. And I could just go like this, but like I said, I wanna fill them in a little bit. We're gonna go in with Honey Coral Tinted Lip Balm. This is on sale. This is in the uh, Plump and Pucker, Plump and Pout <laughs> uh, deal. You can get this Honey Coral Tinted Lip Balm. So soft, just gives a little bit of color. You can get this Nude Pink Lip Color Tiramisu Gloss and Lip Volumizer, and it's only $99. It's supposed to be 118. And if you're a Kiss and Tell for a customer on my website, you can get it for 89. And don't forget the other stuff on my website while I'm kind of letting my brows dry before I go in with my angled brush. Um, the, um, what was I gonna say? The, uh, the deals on my website are um, this month. Don't forget um, the deals on my website. If you buy anything, you'll get a free sample. If you spend 100, you get free shipping, a free sample, and a free gift. And if you spend 150, you get a free sample, a free gift, free shipping and a free surprise product and a makeup bag. And they're good products, they're retired products. So definitely don't wanna miss out. Okay, this is the new Smoky Taupe, okay? So that's the new color I'm gonna wear on my eyes. Oh, and actually we'll do my brows and then I was gonna throw a little tinted moisturizer on. I'm doing a different brush than normal. I don't know if I'm gonna like this one with the Smoky Taupe as much, but it'll work. And I'm gonna do. Switching it around. I did not put a base on my eyes. I'm gonna put on tinted moisturizer. So this is something I don't normally do, but if you're in a pinch, you can do something quick. You can use it as a base, but I wouldn't use it every day as a base. I would use sandstone pearl. Okay, I'm actually gonna go in straight with this brush. 
and fill it in. And then use this. So it just gives it a little bit more of a fill in, but nothing too bold. Like it's like you didn't try, but you tried. Cause that's what I think of when I go think of the beach. You wanna, you don't want everybody to know you like got ready, but you wanna feel put together. And I'm just not one of those people that can roll out of bed and look all put together. I feel like that's only in the movies. <laughs> okay, let's do, this is the smoky taupe, you guys. This color, great everyday color. It's less brown than the other shadows we have. Like we have Mocha Java, I'm just gonna do a nice light layer where it's gonna give me just a little color, not too much. I could put another layer if I wanted to, but it's just gonna kind of give my eyes a little bit. Let's do a little more. So it's a brown, neutral, a little more on the cool side. Mocha Java is more warm. So if you do like Mocha Java, I would suggest grabbing this one or if you want like good day, color like if you like sandstone pearl go ahead and grab it all right um now we're gonna do my mascara and I'm gonna do just a little bit of this is the white translucent powder just to kind of give that tinted moisturizer a little bit of a set not a setting powder or setting spray or anything like that but it just kind of Puts it on a plate, so it's kind of a setting powder, I guess. Okay, then I'm just gonna do my mascara and my primer, and I'll be ready to go. So it's just, this took me seven minutes. If I didn't talk, it would I could have done it in like three or four minutes. So this is your quick out the door, in a few minutes look, just to feel more put together so if you need a color match on anything let me know the only thing really i guess you'd have to color match would be the tinted moisturizer other than that you could literally just grab the whole thing and it's going to work for all skin tones and our mascara grab the waterproof for the beach this is going to last you all day i'm going to be going under the water putting my goggles on i need to get another mascara open this is getting to the end you can tell when <laughs> your first wipe doesn't do much it's because you're almost out i have to open another one and i just pile it on and mascara is what's really going to wake you up too it's going to make you look like you're awake and i love that it's not clumpy it's not like it looks natural that's what i like about it and i probably won't go in, in with as many layers as i normally would you could not do the bottom if you don't want to i'm just a bottom mascara kind of person so let's do a little more i just like lashes but i won't do as much as i normally do couple extra on the outside and look at how much that just makes me feel put together we're gonna go to the beach today and then we're gonna come back we're gonna watch some husker football and do some decorating for fall Got my fall tubs out. We'll see what I packed. I don't know if I packed everything. We already discovered that a few boxes of things that we thought we had packed, we did not pack them, in fact. And we don't know if we donated them or not. It was some kitchen stuff, so we are not sure. It was kind of a frenzy getting everything packed ourselves in those in our pods. So we have been finding we're missing quite a few things in our lives, but we also remember it's just material things and it'll be okay. But sometimes I was a little sad that I didn't have any more, but we will get through it. So we're going to see what fall stuff we packed. All right. 
We are ready. There we go. All right.